Shashas Jazz Factory, your entertainment jazz galore. Let's welcome to a sad news, and this one is about the English singer in the person of Liam Payne, who actually was a member of the boys group that was um, One Direction, yeah, which consisted of, you know, Zin Malik, you know, Harry Styles, and a collection of other guys. Like, they were such a great brotherhood kind of vibe back in those days. They've given us great tunes. Until 2016, they decided to go and lose the thing, like they became defunct, if I should put it that way. So, they all decided to go their solo ways. That is how we got to hear of Harry Styles doing the solo music. We also heard of Zayn Malik doing his solo music and now, you know, Liam Payne also doing his solo music kind of thing. But just about yesterday, this past Wednesday in Buenos Aires, uh, we don't hear say Liam is late and he fell from the third floor of a hotel in Buenos Aires. Um, if you should follow, you know, Liam for some time now, we all know that he's been battling, you know, some mental issues and all of that. So the only thing that he says becomes his cope mechanism for him is, you know, resorting to drugs and alcohol. So clearly the guy is not in, like, a good state. And uh, just like we saw yesterday, he fell from the third floor of the hotel in Buenos Aires, and he was spotted on the floor, like he's dead. Now the conversation is, how did he end up there? People are saying maybe he committed suicide, someone say maybe someone pushed him, we can't really tell what the narrative is. But, but what we're hearing, when we scooped into his hotel, you know, um, not, the, the place was in a mess, like it was totally in a mess. And according to what we're hearing, he was acting paranoia while in the hotel. So at a point, he drank too much, um, the alcohol to the had also. So he wasn't himself in the hotel. So one of the hotel attendees actually drew the attention of the securities and called people to come to his, his, you know, his abode to take good care of him because the guy wasn't fit and fine. So that was the scenery after people got to hear that he actually fell from the third floor of the hotel. So clearly, Liam is literally late. I uh, with him just about last night. And this this is crazy. And according to narrative we hear about this guy literally, well, he's been battling this based on him being famous. Since he became famous, he became a public figure. And, ah, life hasn't been easy for him. That is how come he's been, you know, resorting to drug abuse and all of that, like drinking, you know. Oh, Charlie, the guy's got through a lot. That brings the conversation that being a celebrity is not an easy task. Oh. See, we, let's put aside the fame and the entitlement and the privileges among us. But your personal life, People don't know what you're going through. There are a lot of things people go through that they don't even tell us about, so we don't know. But this guy's been battling with mental health like for ages. So maybe that could be the reason why he took his own life, because according to conversations, he was drunk in the hotel. And he was acting paranoia until, before we could say Jack, you know, he, from the, the window, back to the floor. And that is it. But we're scooping into the narrative as well, and we'll get to let you know what will develop on this particular one. But while we're reminiscing on his death and some of the things he's offered the world, let's take a look at his video first, too. When we come back, we'll talk more. 